Hi, it's good to be with you again. I enjoy our times together. And today we're going to be talking about exercise as God's children. What better place to be than here in this portion of our family room where I have some exercise equipment. You know what exercise is, right? Uh, here in my God Loves You bag, I have an example. Here, have you seen people use weights like this? They want to strengthen their arms and, and they use weights. That's a type of exercise. Well, in, in my exercise time, I try to strengthen my arms, my legs, and my heart. In doing that, I, uh, I need to tell you that over the years, I have gotten some exercise equipment. For instance, this is called a stationary bike. It's like a bicycle, only it remains in one place. It remains stationary. Uh, somebody else owned it before I did. Uh, it's a rather old piece of exercise equipment, and, and, uh, but it works well. When I use this, I can read a book, like my Bible, which is always in my God Loves You bag. Uh, so when I start up, I can read at the same time that I'm exercising. And we've been looking at the book of Acts, and a portion of the book of Acts, Acts chapter 17, verse 28, says this. God gives us the power to live, to move, and to be who we are. We are God's children. Each type of exercise equipment that I have can remind us of how we can exercise as God's children. As you've seen, being on a stationary bike reminds us that we can read the Bible. That's a good way to learn about God's love and about what Jesus did for us on the cross and dying for our sins, that he came to life on Easter morning, and that he went up into heaven. All that is in the Bible, and I get to read it as I exercise. And thinking of our verse for today, knowing about God's love and what Jesus did and taught gives us the power to live. The verse then goes on to talk about the power to move, which takes us to another piece of exercise equipment in just a moment. This piece of equipment is called an elliptical trainer. It helps me move not only my legs, as I did on the stationary bike, but also, as you can see, my arms. It reminds me how Jesus said to move through life by caring about others. Remember the story of the Good Samaritan? The Good Samaritan showed he cared by helping a stranger. We can do that too, even in these COVID-19 times. As I catch my breath, I want to say, I've mentioned before how you can care for others by placing items in the blessing box, which is at the front of our church building. The blessing box provides a way for people in our community to get some important things, things that they need like food or small items of clothing. Now looking again at our verse for today, it talks about the power to be who we are. Then it says, we are God's children. You know, how else can we exercise as God's children? We thought about reading the Bible and we thought about caring for others and helping them. Let's go to one more piece of equipment to think of a third thing we can do to exercise as God's children. This is a jogging trampoline. No matter what the weather, sunny, rainy, even snowy, I can jog right here in my home. And that reminds me of our verse where it says, be who you are. One way we can do that as God's children is to be honest about who we are as we pray. Just as you talk honestly to your family and friends about what you're thinking or feeling, you can talk to God in that same way. So, on my jogging trampoline, just as I'm talking to you, I can also talk to God. 
even with my eyes open. I keep them open so I can make sure I stay in the center of my jogging trampoline. Let's pray right now as we come to the end of our time together. Now you can fold your hands and close your eyes if you'd like. Let's pray. Dear God, we thank you that we can exercise as your children. We thank you that we can live by reading the Bible. We can move as we care about others and help them. And we can be who we are as we talk honestly to you in prayer. Help us to do each of these things. In Jesus' name we pray. And all God's children say, Amen. Thanks for spending time with me today as we learn how to exercise as God's children. I look forward to seeing you again. Goodbye for now.